Welcome to the wacky and wonderful world of Yayoi Kusama. The polka dot obsession, hundreds of stuffed cushions, and other works of cheerful exuberance are being exhibited at London's Tate Modern through early June. Multicolored blobs, detailed paintings, strange films, and endless mirrors pull visitors into a unique version of her world, developed over 60 years. You may never have heard of Yayoi Kusama, but in the 60s, she was as famous as Andy Warhol. Then in the 70s, she moved back to Japan, checked herself into a mental hospital, and has lived there ever since. Kusama describes her art as a therapeutic necessity, something she has to pursue to correct a mental disability she says began in her childhood. Curator Frances Morris says despite Kusama's fragile mental state, the artist is a hard worker and innovator. What underpins these very different styles and very different media is a sense of absolute intensity, of obsessional devotion, of absolute integrity, of repetition, of pattern, of always pushing everything to the limits. Works by the 82-year-old artist are increasingly sought after by collectors and now sell for millions of dollars. Kusama came to Britain for the opening and plans to return to her life in a Japanese psychiatric hospital. She says she wants visitors to come away with a simple message. Stop war and celebrate the brilliance of life. Not such a crazy idea. Jessica Baldwin, Al Jazeera, London.